<laughs> What's going on guys Dudley here and we're back to FIFA 14 and we're still in the title matches We are in the semi-finals now and uh, Unfortunately, we can't use our Bundesliga team because Ellie is injured and we have two contracts out So we have to give these two people contracts and go ahead and switch over to the BPL team so that Elia can take a rest and uh, the first team that we come up against is actually a Bundesliga team Mixed with the BPL team, and it looks solid. It looks really solid. Sherla Ramirez, Mkhitaryan, uh, Blashikovsky, Piszczek, Cole. You know, it's, it's just a very solid team overall. However, I do start off the scoring with a nice goal from Benteke. And by nice goal, it's it's obviously not the nicest goal. But it's a, it's a goal nonetheless with Benteke. And it gets us 1-0 up. However, then this happens. He crosses it, hits the bar right off De Gea, and De Gea scores for us. Uh, scores for them, I'm sorry. Even though I gave the goal to Obama Yang, I'm going to go ahead and give that to De Gea. So technically, that's two goals for us already, right? Two goals. So we're now up 2-0 two, two in a perfect world anyway. And right here, De Gea makes a save, and my center back's like, oh, here you go, get another goal. And just hand, it basically puts Mkhitaryan in with a nice through ball. So uh, we got our center back getting a sick assist. And De Gea getting a nice goal, so boom! It, it was a pretty solid game for us. We ended up losing because of those. I don't. I don't even know if it was my fault. Like I can't tr control De Gea, so that was all him. But the defender, like I don't know why he took a horrible touch, passed it to Mkhitaryan, and we actually ended up losing that game. So we head back into cup matches, and this is the first team that we come up against. And this game. This match and the last match, I had actually I had already been quite frustrated with the last match with the, the two goals that I conceded, but this one again, Nazri just rails the ball as hard as he can. It hits De Gea right in the face, and he basically puts it into the back of net. De Gea again, He's getting another goal against us. I don't even know who he's playing for anymore. However, we are able to get a goal back. He passes it to Lucas Leva. Lucas Leva takes a stunning strike from outside the box. And scores a nice goal. Dips right under over the keeper. Keeper it can't get to it. We're up again. We're tied. However, he is able to get another goal with Lacazette. Again, my defender gave him a nice through ball. I don't know why my defending was so poor. I don't even know if it was me. Maybe I was maybe I was really just handing them the ball. I don't know what was going on. But the the, the thing is it, it just kept it, things kept going my opponent's way and it was getting really annoying right here he makes a mistake from a corner I go ahead and put Coutinho all the way through he pulls out the keeper I say I'll be patient and finesse it around you and so I do and now we're tied tied now we're tied tied nope now we're 2-2 and that means that we're gonna go into extra time now I think this is the first time that we've gone into extra time on my channel and I guess there's a first for everything, but right there, again, Hernandez with a stunning strikeout from outside the box. I didn't think it was going to go in, but he had other ideas, and he scores the goal. And, of course, my opponent had a nice goal to match. Uh, get this. I don't know why this is... Look, Cissé gets a nice bicycle kick goal. I'll give him that. However, if you guys go watch that back, Gibbs, who was supposed to be covering Cissé, not only does he bump into Cissé, so he acknowledges that he's there... But he just keeps running right past him and I'm not controlling Gibbs that was not me controlling him so because of that we go into the penalty shootout and I don't even know how to commentate a penalty shootout so I'll try my best however I I don't know I didn't feel like I should have gone into this penalty shootout it wasn't my fault Gibbs decided not to you know not to cover his man and he just left him there but anyway Hernandez takes a nice shot into the left hand corner of the net or at least that's where I tried to aim it it went more towards like the left middle and right here it's his turn and as soon as he did this little stutter step I knew he was going down the middle and I stayed down the middle and uh, that's that's kind of a tip for you guys if if they do that stutter step more often than not they go down the middle but anyway boom with Benteke I take it to the opposite side he guesses left he guessed wrong obviously and then he comes in with Cissé, the goal scorer, who put us into the penalty. And I say, uh-uh, I don't think so. You only get one chance. I dive the right way and take the ball out of the net, basically. Right here with Coutinho, boom, right down the center. I thought he would have guessed that since he's the spot that, since that's the spot that he tried at the very beginning, but decided not to. And it's up with Nazri. Nazri is able to put the ball away, but I only have to score one more time in order to win this penalty shootout and it's to wrap to the spot and boom right to the left again and he didn't guess 
he wins as a penalty to Rop, the man of the match right there, taking us that win, uh, taking us to the quarterfinals, I believe, right? Uh, I think, I'm not sure. But yeah, this was just a frustrating game all around. I have no idea why things weren't going my way. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, let me know in the comments below. And as always, have a great day. Peace.